Greetings Earthlings and welcome back to my channel. Today is Makeup Monday. I'm not too sure what I'm gonna get into. I'm just playing. We're gonna see what happens. I have some PR from ColourPop. This packaging, ColourPop always has the prettiest packaging. I'm going to be playing with their new Tropic Like It's Hot collection, Lush in Paradise. Again, this packaging is so fun. I love it. It's beautiful. So we have the Lush Life palette. We have some mattes and we have some shimmers. And we have three cheek dews. Really pretty colors. And then three of the Lux glosses. These colors are so pretty. And then there are three gel liners. I am going to be doing my hair like this for a while because I'm trying not to do absolutely anything to it. So I literally wash it, let it air dry, and then I just put it like in this little low bun because I just really, for once in my life, want to leave my hair alone. It is really hot. I don't want to go in with like a full coverage foundation. So I really love like a tinted moisturizer in June. Uh, this is the NYX Bear With Me Tinted Skin Veil. If you have been looking for a tinted moisturizer or like a really light, light foundation, this one is great. I also like the Laura Mercier one. This one is more affordable and it's not as dewy as the Laura Mercier. Now you can use a brush or a beauty sponge. I prefer just using my fingers for this product. I just rub it in like moisturizer. You can see it evens everything out. And then I'm going to go in with some concealer. And for my concealer, I will use a brush. I'm going to take the Ilia True Skin Serum Concealer here. Around my nose, under my eyes. Here. I am going to use the It Cosmetics Concealer Brush. And I'm going to blend this out. I really love this concealer. It's... Um, moisturizing it's lightweight but it gives really great coverage i'm just realizing right now that this is a little too light for me right now i've been in the sun recently so i have a little bit of color so this is like i could probably go up a shade right now but it's fine So again, this concealer is really light. I'm going to have to bring some color back into my face when I bronze up. Um, but next, I'm going to go in with the ColourPop Cheek Dew Serum Blush in the shade Hibiscus. I'm going to take some to the back of my hand, just a little. I'm going to take this Laura Mercier Cheek Color Brush, and I'm going to pick it up on the brush, and I'm going to dab this on my cheeks. Ooh, this is nice. I'm also going to take this to my nose. Next, I'm going to take the ColourPop Coastin Super Shock Highlighter. I'm going to use my ring finger to apply this to the highest part of my cheekbone here. This is such a beautiful highlight. So the next thing I'm going to do is set my face and add some color back into it. So I'm going to take the Becky G and ColourPop collab. Uh, this is the LA bronzer. 
Brontoring. Bringing some color here. The jawline. This bronzer is so pigmented, so I have to be careful. <laughs> Tip on my nose. And then I'm also going to go around my forehead here. Next, I'm going to go in with my Huda Beauty. Um, this is in the shade Pound Cake. This is the Easy Bake Loose Baking and Setting Powder. Love this stuff. It's like one of my all-time favorite loose powders. So I'm not going to take this all over my face. I'm only going to go in certain areas. So I'm going to take the Morphe M438 brush, which is this like large, it's like a large crease brush. <laughs> And I'm gonna tap off the excess so I don't have like a glob of powder. I just want like a nice sheer coat. I'm gonna look up. I'm gonna set under my eyes. The sides of my nose here, these little creases. And around my mouth. And the center. Of my forehead normally I do my lips last but I'm gonna go ahead and go in now and do my lips I'm gonna take the luxe gloss in the shade peace lily this gloss is beautiful it's like the perfect nude shade I'm gonna take my good old benefit 24-hour brow setter and I'm just gonna brush my brow hair up and over And then I'm gonna go in with a little bit of brow pencil. I've been trying to take it easy on my brows lately and not go, you know, too harsh or too full, too bold. Just keep them as natural as possible. I'm gonna wait for that brow gel to dry down because if you go in with your brow pencil over like wet brow gel, it's just gonna smear. Like it's not, it's not gonna glide on easy. Okay, so for my eyes, I am going to be using the ColourPop Lush Life palette. I'm going to go in with the shade Eco. I'm going to take that into my crease. And up. I'm going to take the shade Monsoon. And I'm going to pack that onto my lid. Very carefully, I don't want to get fallout. No, I already had one, hun. Whoa, this color is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. Next, I'm going to take on the prowl onto a small crease brush. Tapping off the excess, I'm going to go right into my crease. And start blending this this edge with the green. So I had a little bit of fallout, which I'm so sad about, but we're gonna keep it moving. I'm gonna go in with a small crease brush in the shade Guava. I'll take this to the lower lash line. Pretty heavily. Next, I'm gonna take the cream gel liner in the shade Canopy. I'm going to take that in my waterline Alright, next I'm going to go in with mascara I'm going to take the Laura Mercier Caviar Volume
so this is the finished look i hope you guys enjoyed today's makeup tutorial if you did give me a thumbs up if you didn't give me a thumbs down <laughs> i will see you very very soon peace